do you think we are in terms of the sp space race? I mean, China's doing, uh, I think they've ha had a bunch of manned flights over the last couple of years. You had uh, Japan launch this robot, or soon to launch this robot, I think its name is Karobo, into space to be a little mm -hmm. companion up there. Mm -hmm. How does the U.S. rank in terms of just the globe and what's happening sure. in terms of space race? Well, the U.S. is still a, a gigantic leader, okay, in space and in all different forms. And so the old space race that we have with the Soviet Union is, is long gone. Uh, I don't think there's a space race going on with China, but what is interesting with China is that they're developing space and using space for their own reasons. They're using it to inspire their young people, they're using it to improve their industries, and they're using it as part of their foreign policy. Yeah. So they're using trade with other countries to advance their position. So they're using space in a very integrated way. Do you feel like we're doing that same thing here, using it in that integrated way? No, I think that's actually one of the things where we've, we've fallen down. We've tended to treat our civil and our commercial and our security aspects of space kind of in separate compartments. Uh, and so I think there's opportunities to combine those things to advance our security interests and our commercial and our scientific interests uh, in a more integrated way, but we really haven't done that yet.